good morning, afternoon, evening, YouTubers. Yeah, y'all probably saying, what is this? Ladies and gentlemen, it's been a minute since me and the wife have put out a video, and here we go. As for what you guys see, yes guys, it's a grill. Me and my wife is going to have a small little barbecue in the back. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I have never grilled on my own. Just letting you guys know. But putting these things together, I have done a long time ago when I was living in my hometown and working in the lawn and garden department. So, I hope you guys are ready for the video of trying to put this thing together. And if you guys do not see the full footage, please forgive me. Stay tuned. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I have opened up the box. So, it came with the bottom piece, the top piece, some two wheels, the leg piece, the daggone screws, which looks like I might have to pull out something of my own because I don't see a screwdriver or anything in there. None. None at all, guys. The top part for the handles. And the grill part, which is actually going underneath where the handle goes. You're probably saying, huh? How does she know that? Trust me, I put these things together a long time ago. Um, we have the grill. We have the bottom grill. And another grill. And lucky I got this toolbox. <laughs> so you could tell. I'm ready. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I know you'll probably see half of my body whatsoever. Please forgive me. So, apparently wifey had to step out, so I'm doing this video solo. She had to go get some stuff because we didn't get everything that we need for today's little cookout. So, I'm here putting the grill together. As you can see in the beginning of the video, it was me showing you guys the parts and everything. Now, with me doing the grill, it's going to be very, very interesting. Hope you guys actually enjoy this video, being that wifey is not holding the camera, so you guys can actually see the amount of time it takes me to actually put the stuff together. So the first part that we will be doing inside of this grill is the top part, because it told us to do the top first. Sometimes I wonder about these things. Because sometimes the instructions is backwards and sometimes you go there. Bella! Bella, no! See, this is the part about laying the stuff out. The cats tend to actually get very curious and when I attach stuff. Bella's over there trying to get stuff. Look at this crap. Look, look, look. Bella! Okay, so we're going to um, open up this little toolbox. Well, stuff with the tools in it. If I can get in it. And separate it because we need to do the handle this is the bottom part which we don't need at the moment so that's not the thing we need this part with the handles and our little screws which is a C and D and F and H. So A A C Okay D F H Okay A This 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 is some craziness guys. Oh D craziness put this stuff and that's why I said you need to bring in your own tools you see this guys there's a screw you have to screw it there is no screwdriver with this thing so I would suggest you guys have a tool kit nearby that's the main thing that I want to tell you guys when you put these things together make sure you have a tool kit as you can see inside the video I have my major one so I'll be back to show you what the lid looks like when I'm done Alright, so basically, we need this right here for the lid. We 
getting these things open is not easy. I should have had my bag on cutter and I don't have my cutter. So guess what? You make use of what you got. <laughs> Then you need these. I need this. And C D C A C D. The fan is blowing, so it's kind of hard for me. And we need F. It's pretty simple to get into it if you don't have any tools, which is these wrenches to hold it closed. I don't want to show you, it's really small. Extremely small. Holy moly, it's small. Ooh. You need this. And last but not least, H. Ooh, gosh. This is gonna. It's kind of complicated when you're actually doing it by yourself, but it's okay because I used to put these things together long time ago by myself and um, it was very interesting when I used to work at Walmart now H is the closing thingies okay you know the, the these are the bigger ones so these are the things that I would be using inside the video okay so Stay tuned for the top of the lid. I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I have literally put the first part together, which was very interesting. Come to find out, I didn't need the screwdriver. Thank God! Because sometimes these grills, you actually need the screwdriver because sometimes they don't bolt correctly. So this is the top part that's actually done. Please forgive me with the camera situation. I told you I'm doing this solo. Um, so right here... You got this portion right here, which is the top part, which is very simple. As you can see, it opens, close, open, close. That's wonderful. The handle, it's a little wobbly, so I'm not happy. I'm not happy with the wobbliness, but it's okay. And then underneath here, from what you can see, guys, is where I actually put the pieces together that I needed. That's the first step, guys, and so far. Let's get it going to the next step. Okay, guys. So, as you can see on this thing, this is going to be the fun part about the whole freaking part. Because if you look on the instructions, that looks very interesting, right? Yeah, it is, guys. So, the first piece that I'm going to be doing with the bottom part is this part right here. So, this part has to go here on this side right here you have to pay attention to the dialogue and everything so it can actually work out please forget the camera footage please forget the camera footage so I'll be back to show you guys how this whole bottom part is going to look stay tuned oh my freaking god this thing is not as easy when you're doing it solo so um, <laughs> as you can see the legs a little wobbly because you have to move them to put the bottom piece in there so they said not to tighten it until the bottom grill is in so this is what it looks like <laughs> this was a pain because wifey wasn't here so holding this piece and the other piece to screw that in was a pain in the butt but I got it guys let's keep this thing rolling I can't wait to be done with this shit Whew. 